What's up, guys? We're back. Today we're doing Face Yourself, Dead Reflections, Death Reflection? Death Reflection. Yeah. Death Reflection. Uh, I've heard this band before. I know this girl's got insane fucking vocals. It's featuring Isaac Bilbrey. I know nothing about that dude, but he better be fucking awesome. Before yeah. we get into it, though, don't mind my eye. I've just got allergies out the ass, baby. My wife doesn't beat me. But yeah, I didn't I didn't notice that until you said something. Now yeah. that you said something, I'm going to stare at it the rest I'm, of the time. Yeah, I'm self-conscious, dude. You're going to be reacting to my yeah. fucking eye allergies now. Always Anyways, close your eyes when he's in the vinegar strokes, guy. I got to stop eating ass, dude. That's my problem. <laughs> <laughs> all right let's, we're just gonna hop right into it dude yeah, I'm we're gonna do this face yourself death reflection featuring isaac bilbrey the the one and only isaac bilbrey we googled him right before this and he's he's actually known for being featured in face yourself death reflection which came yeah. out a day ago so if you guys know who he is let us know in the comments because uh i don't know who the fuck he is all right let's go Okay, let's see what comes. Build up. God damn. Okay. That was dope, dude. Yeah. Some boomer bands. Solos. Oh, he took his guitar off. Yeah, what's that? Look at his face right now, dude. He means <laughs> business, dude. He's fucking angry, dude. How many takes did that take for him to get that face? Look at that shit, dude. How many I'm takes gonna... did it take for them to fucking bounce and sink? Uh, that, that takes me back to the fucking crab core days. I, I so I could see this band uh like being on tour with Tactosa. Yes. I think it's kind of return to form Deathcore. She's pretty sick. We got two She's solos. She's awesome, dude. She's killing yep. it. You yep. don't even need that fucking backup vocalist. Get him the fuck out of there. There's no need for it. He's not doing anything cool that she's doing. Yeah, he's singing into a plant leaf. I don't know why that is. The only thing about this video I don't understand is the is the plants. Yeah. They kind of sporadically <laughs> spread. I was gonna say it's like beautifully arranged, but for what? Exactly? I don't even know if it's beautifully arranged. It's just plants <laughs> <Yeah>. hanging. <laughs> They're just like, um, you know what? We need something billowy right here. Let's put some plants. I don't. Yeah, I don't know why they they put the plants in there. But I mean, hey, it does have something to do with the lyrics. I'm or getting something, some uh, some heavy healing crystal vibes from this metal. Yes, band. that's kind of what I was trying to go for there. I mean, there's plenty of oxygen in that room. Maybe, yeah, maybe that's sure. what they're going for. I don't know whether to stare back at this guy. That's the face I make whenever we're going at a doggy style, dude. When it's missionary, it's like an Usher video. You know, it's all sweet and sensual. Second she turns around, it's that dude's face. Uh, that's what the uh, treasure goblin in Diablo 4 sees when he turns around. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> Before my barbarian fucking decimates it, dude. <laughs> oh, All right, shit. let's finish this up. All right, let's do it. Oh, he put it back on. Singing into that plant. Okay. Nice. All right. No, that was pretty good, man. That's um yeah. it's definitely a return to form deathcore, you know, like I would say early two thousands, maybe a little like MySpace era which isn't a bad thing. I, th- I think we could go back and explore it a little bit more. No, it's a... Uh, that was sick, dude. They got a lot of hype on them. I can see why. I know their their EP uh, did really well for a band who's like kind of just starting out like they are. They're probably trying to get out some new singles real quick to keep riding the wave. That's what I assume. But it, I mean, it was solid. It was, it yeah. was good. Stuff. And you know what? It's really cool to see that all these, uh, you know, female-fronted bands and i mean they're doing just as well vocally i mean this girl kills it dude i would love to have the fucking vocal range that she does dude i mean she's fucking incredible so yeah hats off now we're gonna go listen to the other song they just dropped other thing i'd say about the female vocalist stuff is some people put too much emphasis on it it's like we know female vocalists can do are capable of doing the same shit as like dude vocalists so Let's get past that and just listen to how it sounds. And if it sounds good, I think it doesn't matter if they're male or female. Not to make it like this all political or anything, but it's like, <laughs> I think I, don't I guess I, I'm just going to talk. So fuck off. But um, <laughs> I could see it like people probably were kind of gatekeepy in the beginning, like didn't take like female fronted bands kind of seriously. Yeah, I could see that. Yeah. So you know, that's probably why there's emphasis put on it. I, I mean, I don't give a shit either way. She sounds brutal. so. That's all I give a fuck. If they were, that definitely doesn't exist anymore. But like yeah, we all yeah, know, yeah. there's been plenty of friggin' stellar female lead singers now, man. That was like Slayer days. Is more yeah, exactly. What I did. <laughs> exactly. What I was getting at is that isn't why this band is cool. They're cool because they sound cool. Yes, that's, absolutely. That's what it is. That's all I got. So that was a good one. All right, guys. Uh, we're off to the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We appreciate it a lot. It helps us out. And we're going to go listen to some new music later. Peace out. <laughs>